Good morning, it's Wednesday and we're on the Willoway Dock. Look at these great looking plants loading on the dock today. Let's take a quick walk through. Here we're looking at some gorgeous 15 gallon, these are sugar maple, Green Mountain. Look at these barberries, they really shine out. Bright yellow, we have uh, some very nice plants here. Look at this one, this is Admiration. Beautiful plant. So on this order here, we're looking at some very nice two gallon um, green velvet boxwood. Really nice value, good retail uh, price point. Two gallon green velvet. Here's an order of our uh, three gallon Ilex in uh, these blue hollies and threes. We've got a great selection of varieties. Really nice heavy 15 to 18 inch plants. Nice color here. We have uh, Rainbow Sensation in a three gallon. Really nice variegated color. And uh, look at these Echinaceas, all bud and bloom. Good selection of varieties. Beautiful big plant. And then next to them, check out these hemlocks. Those are three gallon hemlocks. Uh, really nice price point for retail. Well, grasses are hot right now. We're looking at uh, heavy metal and Cheyenne Sky. And look at the color on these. Here we have our three gallon mop cypress. More potted trees here. I want to also bring attention. Aronia right now is starting to bury up. Here we're looking at Viking. Really nice heavy fruit set on these three gallons. This is a great fall color plant. Again, Barberry's a hit. We're looking at uh, Royal Burgundy here. I wanted to show you our three gallon green velvets. Heavy, nice, full 15 inch plants. And then look at these, Mr. Bowling Ball. Nice, consistent pull, gorgeous plant. And here we're looking at Budlia. Really nice three gallons. These are starting to bud up and look really nice here. You can see the buds starting to form. Going to give you a lot of color. We have a great selection of Budley and three gallons. This one happens to be pink microchip. We just came in here. We're looking at our seven gallon hydrangea limelights, and uh, they're coming out of a trim here. You see the nice uh, bud and bloom on these. Really good value. And then down here, you know, the bloomerangs are starting to rebud and bloom. Big full plant. Again, grasses are hot, and here we're looking at a panic, and this is Cheyenne Sky. Here's some more trees to look at. We have 15 gallon. These are Acer Brandywine. Really nice full heads and 15s. And another look at those 7 gallon limelights. Again, they're just coming out bud and bloom. Got a lot of nice color to come on them. 7 gallon limelights. So I wanted to show you these. These are just now shipping. This one uh, retail um, plant awards at the Cultivate Show and it was very hot at the IGC Show in Chicago. This is Chick Charms. We have some shipping now. Well, it just came in of our uh, limelight hydrangeas and a uh, very nice fresh crop of three gallon limelight. See the bud and bloom on these beauties here. Our uh, perennial hibiscus is coming into bud and bloom. Here we have a second crop of them. Gorgeous full plants. This happens to be one and two gallons here, but good assortment. Be sure to check that availability. Hydrangeas are coming on and we got a nice crop here. We're looking at uh, vanilla strawberry in a three gallon and uh, another fresh new crop. Beautiful, nice, big, rounded plant, and you can see they're just starting to throw flowers, so we have some time on them. And we'll pan over here. I wanted to show you these two-gallon bloom trucks shipping out right now. Again, very nice, full plant, bud and bloom, looking great. Bloom truck in a two, and then this one's been a hot one. We have a fresh crop of uh, incredible hydrangea. This one is uh, an improvement over the Annabelle, and again, a nice full crop coming out. You can see here, uh, beautiful threes. Incredible. Well, a lot of trees are hot on the dock today. Here we're looking at a big bunch of uh, 15 gallon. This is Frank's Red, all tied up and ready for shipment. Exceptional crop of uh, 15 gallon uh, red maples here. Good fall sales. Acer Red Sunset. Pan up and down here, we're looking at our 25 gallon. This is Cully Birch. Well, if you're doing a landscape job and you're looking for taxes, here's a very versatile one. This is 7-gallon uh, Wardai taxes. Big, heavy 7 gallons. This is an exceptional value for your landscape jobs. 7-gallon Wardai. Pulled one of these 7-gallon trellis pyracanth off to show you the value. Um, big, full plant, and they're just starting to set fruit. So these will have a nice uh, fall berry set for you. You can see the fruit starting here. Um, gorgeous plant, great value. This is a 7 gallon Pyracantha Yukon Bell. These have been a real hot plant on the dock. This is a Ramnus Fine Line in our 3 gallon size. Uh, really big full plants, good value. And again we're looking at our limelight trees. And we'll zoom down here, check these out. Gorgeous big 
uh, five gallon arborvitae. Just came in. Uh, we have uh, three gallon. These are spilled wine. Very nice three gallon. Here we have uh, the guys have tied them up, getting ready to go on a truck. But these are seven gallon Hetz Columnaris, and uh, got a really nice uh, crop of these. This would be great for retail and or landscaping. And uh, they also have a fall fruit. But look at this gorgeous full plant. Seven gallon Hetz Columnaris. I pulled one of these out to give you another look at our three gallon holly. We're looking at three gallon blue maids. Look at that nice full plant, lush new growth, good value on these. Blue maids in them. You guys are bringing in some really nice three gallon blue point junipers. And here we're looking at our three gallon Alberta spruce. I'm just capturing here a few uh, videos here on the stuff coming up to the dock. Here we have our three gallon blue marine. Another great wagon here. We got our. Uh, Fall blooming clematis here, nice bud and bloom plants. Look at these endless summers, gorgeous full threes. More of those uh, paniculata clematis, and again we see the uh, bud and bloom. These are uh, cranberry crush, nice two gallon plant here. Curiopteris is another great fall blooming plant. We see uh, bud and bloom on these here, look at that. Gorgeous plant. Really nice fall color. Well, here we see a few wagons coming in on roses here. We got our two gallon roses. Let's come in here and look at the bud and bloom status on those. Heavily budded. Really nice two gallon plants. We're just seeing these wagons come in here. We're looking at pink chiffon. I'll come in here and look at the bud and bloom on these. They're just going to explode with color. And here we have lavender chiffon, another really nice heavily budded crop. Gorgeous three gallons, really good value, a lot of color. Here we have our uh, three gallon yucca color guard, another blast of really nice color. Here we got a pallet of our two gallon little princess spirea, what a value on these. Here we have an order, this is uh, Physocarpus summer wine. These have been trimmed up, flush of new growth, nice tight compact color plant. Summer wine. Well, this pretty bright holly we have here is Honey Made, and that's a variegated uh, blue holly. And then look at the bud and bloom on these beauties. This is uh, Purple Haze. We're looking at anemones. We've got a nice selection of anemones. We have Cinderella, Pocahontas, all of which are really nice bud and bloom plants. We've got a very nice consistent pull, and these are our 15 gallon, uh, these are green giants. Look at the color on these beauties. This is Tiger Eye Sumac. And uh, really nice bright chartreuse. You can see they're starting to get a little bit of their fall color, so that extended right into the season. Tiger and crop of three gallon. This is uh, Physocarpus Little Devil. I'm showing you another shot at our new crop of three gallon Incredible. And we have a really nice consistent pull on these three gallon. These are Buxus Winter Gem. And then next to them, if you're doing a landscape job, check out these 15 gallon. These are Texas cap. Well, grasses are looking outstanding. We have a three gallon. This is variegated miscanthus. We have Cheyenne Sky. And then we're coming over here to our three gallon gracilimus. Check out these allium. Uh, they're all up, budded bloom. Outstanding uh, color on these. This is Medusa. Hey, these beautiful sedum that we're looking at here is a sun sparkler called uh, Dazzleberry. And you can see the flower on these really exploding in color. Look at the color on these beauties. This is a uh, two gallon moon shadow euonymus. Really nice uh, two gallon drift roses. Um, nice bud and bloom plants that we're looking at here. This one is a uh, coral drift. A glimpse of those uh, Ramnus fine line, and then next to them, we're looking at uh, the bud and bloom. This is Little Kim, uh, two gallons here with a big impact of color. Well, as you can see here, we still have a lot of beautiful echinaceas. Um, the ha this one happens to be Julia and Cleopatra. Good selection of those. And then I'm going to kind of go over here in this order and show you the bud and uh, berry that we have here. This is the Hypericum series from. Uh, First editions, we got a great selection of them, heavily fruited plants. The color we're looking at here is on Physocarpus Amber Jubilee. And I wanted to show you these Caryopteris. This is Caryopteris season. Look at the buds on those. Awesome uh, display of color. Here we have Dark Knight and Petite Blue. Now we're looking at our new crop. This is uh, Hydrangea Paniculata. This is Mystical Flame. And uh, 
very hot ticket plant, high demand, brand new crop. They look sensational. Okay, we're looking at more of those gorgeous summer wines. We have our three gallon uh, Texas Hicks High, looking very nice, full plants. Uh, in the background there we have seven gallon limelights and uh, they're, they're going out of bloom but they're still a big beautiful plant. Pulled a few of these uh, Lemon Daddy Hydrange out. Look at the nice chartreuse color on those. Very nice full plant. In the background there we have a few of our Cranberry Creeks and seven. These beauties here, this is Lavender Silver Mist. And you can see they're throwing flower like crazy. Some exceptional looking uh, Calicarpa and this is Early Amethyst. And you can see here they're just starting to bud out, show some color. These babies are going to explode with flower. Calicarpa early in. Here's a small look at our uh, seven gallon Ramnus fine lines. These are beautiful uh, plants. Landscape ready. A load coming in from the greenhouse and uh, we got some gorgeous garden mums here. Look at that. Cracking color. Beautiful big plant. Here's some more coming in from our uh, greenhouse. Beautiful big. Uh, we're looking at cabbage and kale. Uh, very nice crop, exceptional uh, color for fall, and uh, this actually makes a great landscape plant as well. Tip one of these over to show you, look at the size on that kale. Big, beautiful plants. Don't forget your pansies. Looking at uh, three gallon Penicetum Hamel, and you can see they're all up in flower. Really nice value on these. Great looking plants here. We have our three gallon China Girls. Really nice three gallon value. Look at these three gallon Penicetum redheads. And then next to them, another exceptional value, our 19 centimeter. This is Gracilla. I just wanted to peek in the truck here. They're getting ready to unload it, but this is our uh, Junkus grass. We got an exceptional value, and this makes a great combination plant in your fall container. These are in the back of this pallet, but I think you can see the bud and bloom on those. This is our uh, Symphocarpus or coral berries. And of course they'll bloom and they come out, every one of those will be a berry. So that's an awesome fall color plant. Some four well, cards. That'll conclude our dock walk for the day and I wanted to end up here with some great looking color. Again the echinaceas are just outstanding. Uh, we've seen perennials, shrubs, trees, a lot of color both in flower and fall color. Be sure to check that availability and I hope we're loading that truck for you.